It's a lovely day for coffee. So today is the day to shoot the shit, as they say. Hmm, let's talk personal training from a personal trainer's aspect. Way, way back, personal trainers weren't a big thing. You probably, I remember when I trained and there's probably one or two in the gym overall. Now it is such a saturated market, but in a good way, but it is such a saturated market. There's loads of personal trainers and as a personal trainer, I've got to find a way to set myself aside from everyone else. Because if I don't set myself aside from everyone else, if I don't make it the reason that you come to me any different from Joe blogs over here, then you're gonna get really like lost with the amount of trainers there are. So I've gotta find a way to set myself aside from other people. The way I choose that is social media and content providing. So if I can provide like vlogs and daily workouts and things like that, you probably get used to seeing my face and then find me more welcoming and then feel that, yeah, I wouldn't mind actually one-on-one -on -one personal training with him. Now, obviously a massive part of personal training nowadays, which has gone a step further since we've got into the media age, is the fact that we offer online content. Everybody offers online content. If you aren't a tr or if you're a personal trainer and you don't offer online content, you really need to consider that. Um, it is something, it's like an untapped market in a sense. Not everyone wants one-to-one -one contact with you, but most people are happy to take advice from you. So if I can also say, right, I've got a facility, I've got a studio, I would love you to come to the studio and we'll do one-to-one. -one. That does cost more because you're taking up my physical time. That's one option, or the other option then is the online PT. You like me, you like how I get on, you like the way I preach sort of fitness things, and you believe what I say, so then you want to come to me and say, right, I want an online program from you. So then I draw up an online program and say, there you go, take the program. Now you're not having as much interaction as my personal studio clients, but you're still getting interaction with me. That makes you happy, you go off. If I have a fancy wee app and you use the app and then you're like, yeah, that's all cool. So then as a personal trainer, we've got to find a way to bring that to you, make that available to you. So we try to research apps. So at the minute I'm trying to research different apps to make this more user friendly. At the minute I have an app I use, and I don't mind dropping the name Mind Body. Um, it's very good for classes, but it's just not geared for PTs. I'm paying an extortionate amount per month to have this app, and really, for the value that I'm paying, I am not getting what I require from it. So I will be moving apps. I'm looking to different things. Um, Trainerize is a massive one. Um, PT Hub. There's loads. My Fitness Trainer or something. Not my Fitness Pal. My Fitness Trainer. Um, those are all things which I can offer clients so then they register to that, they register to my brand, my name, and then they go through my workouts which I set them. I need to go and grab a coffee. Quick coffee and then we're back to more chat. Yes, let's go. on the agenda is moustaches. So you've probably realized from my talking constantly about these stupid moustaches that I'm actually doing Movember. So I am f currently forming a group. Now this does need you, this needs you. So I'm gonna get a crew together. It's gonna be like Jossie Pops fitness crew or Jossie Pops crew. Now along with that, I'll be doing ru some running thing, which I'll divulge later. But for the moment, it's literally anyone who fancies raising money for Movember. We'll all grow moustaches together. We'll be part of a group. We'll raise money for one big thing. So Movember will hopefully recognize that and say, yeah, you guys are cool. And I've been speaking to some people at Movember, so we could get a bit of cool publicity and stuff from it. And I've reached out to other brands like sporting brands and stuff. So could get some gear there for running and stuff. So it could be one massive big collaboration, but the best thing about it is it's for charity. So I've been doing regular vlogs and running and growing weird mustaches and yeah, it's gonna be class. So if you're interested in par being part of my Jussie Pops' Mo Crew, then yeah, get in touch. And that is anyone, that is everyone. So if you're watching this video, you are welcome. And that is male and female. I think females can get in touch too. With regards, obviously you're maybe not gonna grow a mustache, but you can get in touch and maybe do the run inside of it. So it's all cool. Yeah, if you like this style of vlog, make sure to let me know down below. Gotta go, people. See you later.